Hi everyone, welcome to the Droidgy channel. Today's video will explain to you Android phone won't auto rotate. The auto rotate feature in Android phones can automatically switch between landscape and portrait modes based on how we hold the phone. While you are watching the video, just place your Android phone horizontally to rotate the screen to landscape mode. All this is done by relying on the accelerometer in the Android phone. The accelerometer can detect the orientation of the phone and rotate the screen to landscape or portrait mode. But sometimes the auto rotate feature on Android may stop working and cause the Android phone screen won't rotate problem. If you have this problem and watch this video, we will solve this problem for you. Please be patient and watch this video for the phone models including Samsung, Huawei, Xiaomi, OnePlus, Vivo, Oppo, Sony, LG, HTC. We often take the screen auto rotation feature of Android phones for granted, but when you try to turn the phone to change the landscape or portrait mode, you find that the Android phone does not respond. Do you think about why does my Android not auto rotate anymore? Generally speaking, this problem may occur because the auto rotate option is turned off or not working, auto rotate is not set, you are touching the screen while rotating, a recent app is interfering with the auto rotate feature, the accelerometer is malfunctioning and cannot recognize whether the Android device is rotated, and the phone firmware problem may also be one of the reasons for auto rotate won't work on Android phone. According to our inquiries, your Android phone is not the only one with this problem. So don't worry. Usually this problem occurs in the specific settings of the Android phone, which is also the first step we should check. Here we show you some simple fixes on how to fix an Android screen that won't rotate so that your Android phone can rotate automatically. If you think this video is good, you can subscribe, like or leave a comment to let us know which method helped you solve the problem of phone screen isn't rotating. Method 1 is to check and turn on the auto rotate feature. Usually, the auto rotate feature is turned on by default when you first receive the phone, but you can always set the portrait or landscape mode according to your needs and preferences. If you set the portrait or landscape mode, it also means the same as turning off the auto rotate feature. At this time, you may mistakenly think that auto rotate doesn't work on Android phone. To check and turn on the auto rotate feature, swipe down from the top of the screen to open the quick panel. If auto rotate is currently enabled, the auto rotate icon will be highlighted. Conversely, if auto rotate is currently disabled, a gray portrait or landscape mode icon will be displayed. If the icon locks the screen in portrait or landscape mode, tap the icon to activate the auto rotate feature. With the auto rotate icon highlighted, you can turn the phone again to see if the screen can rotate. If your phone's home screen cannot rotate, then you also need to set the home screen rotation feature. Here are the steps to set the home screen rotation feature on the Samsung A53 phone. Open settings, scroll down to find and tap the home screen option. Then swipe down again, find rotate to landscape mode and turn it on. In addition, Android allows you to temporarily disable the auto rotate feature by long pressing the display. Because the Android phone screen is a touch screen, if your finger is pressed somewhere on the screen when rotating the phone, the Android phone will not rotate automatically. So when you need to rotate the phone, only hold the edge of the phone body to ensure that you do not touch the screen. Method 2 is to restart the Android phone. Sometimes, minor bugs in Android can cause system functions to malfunction. Restarting your phone clears the system memory, which can often fix many oddities. Restarting your phone can not only fix the Android screen won't rotate problem, but it can also fix slow phone problems. To restart your Android phone, press and hold the power button for a few seconds until the power menu appears. Then tap the restart icon in the power menu. Your Android phone will then automatically restart. When the phone restarts, rotate the screen again to see if the problem persists. Method 3 is to delete recently installed apps. If your phone screen stopped rotating after you installed a specific app, the app may be interfering with the phone's auto-rotate feature. You may find Android screen not rotating when you use your phone after downloading it. In this case, remove the app from your phone and see if the problem persists. Find the recently installed app on your Android phone screen and long press the app icon. Then tap uninstall. Once the uninstall is complete, you can try rotating your phone again to see if it works. If not, you can restart your Android phone again and try rotating the phone screen again after the restart is complete. Method 4 is to start your phone in safe mode. Another way to check if the app is causing the Android screen not rotating is not working problem is to start your phone in safe mode. Safe mode only runs the base Android operating system. Any app you have installed will not run in safe mode. If there is no problem in safe mode, then the problem may be caused by a third-party app installed on your phone. To enter safe mode, press and hold the power button until the shutdown screen is displayed. On the shutdown screen, tap and hold the shutdown icon until the screen displays the safe mode option. After safe mode appears, tap safe mode. Your phone will restart to return to the home screen in safe mode. Finally, try rotating the Android phone screen in safe mode to check if it works properly. Method 5 is to update your Android phone. New operating system updates often include fixes for bugs and other issues. 
If there are any new viruses or malware that affect auto rotation, the latest update may include a patch to fix the Android phone auto rotate not working problem. To update your Android phone, tap settings, find system and tap to enter the system interface, then tap software update or system update. Here you can see if there are any pending system updates. If so, install it now. After waiting for the update to be installed, your phone may restart automatically. Once you are done, rotate the screen again to see if it rotates normally. Method 6 is to restore the factory settings. If you still cannot rotate the screen after trying these fixes, restoring the factory settings will be the last resort. Restoring the factory settings can solve most problems except for hardware problems of Android phones, including the problem of Android phone auto rotate doesn't work. But before we start, we need to remind you that restoring the factory settings will delete all data on your Android device. If you need data, please back it up in advance. To restore the Android phone to factory settings. First, please click on the phone's settings, enter the settings, find and click general management, find the reset option in the general management interface, click the reset option, find and click restore factory settings. After confirming the deletion on the new interface, your Android phone will enter the factory settings restore program. At this time, your Android phone should automatically restart. Please wait patiently for the phone to restart. After the phone restarts, you will need to reset it like a new phone. After entering the home screen, please try to rotate the Android phone directly, and your Android phone screen should change the horizontal and vertical screen state as you rotate it. Method 7 is to seek help from professionals. If the screen won't auto-rotate on Android phone issue is still not resolved, the root cause may be a hardware failure, such as a damaged sensor, which may require professional repair. You need to take your phone to an official service center for a technician to help you check and fix the issue. That's all for today's video. If you find this video helpful and think we did a good job, please like and share it and tell us which method helped you solve the problem in the comment section. At the same time, if you think we need to improve, you can also tell us your opinions and suggestions in the comment section. Thank you. Good luck.